Hey Collective, and welcome back to my channel, Empress Intuition 1111. Hey, we're going to do some late night witching hour messages. I am going to give you guys the channel messages and downloads. Um, I do want to say thank you to all my new subscribers and my real supporters. I do appreciate you guys. It is not going unnoticed. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I do want to thank my ancestors as well, the Most High. And I do want to call upon my archangels to protect me while I channel the messages for the collective. Any more, any dark magic been thrown at me or the channel, make it all fall down and turn out for my highest good as usual. Okay, so somebody said, why you hoes so jealous? Why you can't just get up and get a bag? Why you so mad? Why you so worried about somebody else's bag? Y'all mad? Y'all jealous? For what? And somebody also said, they said you fell off. Bitch, never. Somebody says you fell off. You ain't have something or you wasn't doing something. And somebody said, bitch, never. And you're pretty and savage out here. I just seen 103. Your birthday could be January 3rd or the 3rd of any month. Okay? And yeah, cop this tea. Bitch, catch it. I just seen 111. Yeah. Someone doesn't want to snooze and miss the moment. So they feel like you're the perfect one for them. You're the perfect person. And they don't want to miss out on such a great opportunity. I just seen 121. And there's chaos turned into clarity. So whatever is miscombobulated will be fixing, will be fixed and fixed. Okay, it's going to be fixed. It's bringing in clarity with all the angels and the ancestors. They coming in. And somebody's been A1 since day one. And you're just too important. Like, they feel like you're just way too important. And somebody is a non-factor as bitch. If you know, you know. Somebody's a non-factor. They want to be so relevant, so important. They want some kind of attention. 155. They could be doing little things to try to get anything through skin, but that's not working. So, yeah. If somebody says you a bad little vibe. Like, they love your vibe. I just seen 206. Somebody thinks your vibe is so good. You're so fun. You're a great person to be around. You a whole vibe. You funny as fuck. I just seen 212. And loving somebody ain't easy. It's hard. Excuse me. Confirmation 215 on a timer. Somebody said trying to love somebody is hard. 222 on a timer. This person is not in the right alignment. Like y'all can have sex. Y'all can go out to eat. But this person is just not easy to love. When it's time to have a real conversation, they're not there. When it's time to talk about something serious, they're goofy as fuck. So it's like, I don't know. But it's going down. It's going down right now. I'm hearing that it's going down. And somebody's steady creeping with the same girl they told you not to worry about. And somebody's absolutely delusional out here. I don't know what's wrong with 250 on the timer. Somebody needs to get it together with 702 as well. And you're their number one hater and their number one fan all in one. So somebody hates you and loves you at the same time. They're really confused and super delusional. And someone has a whole other life, two kids and a wife. It's something about last night changed forever. Hmm. We're going to get into it and see what's going on. We are probably just going to use the ancestors. What does the ancestors want you to know? I just seen 328 on the timeline. Ooh. Okay, yeah, we're gonna hop into it. Somebody real jealous of somebody, you know, they're hating on you right now because you're doing good, looking good, feeling good. They want to try to make you feel like them. They want to put this negative energy off onto you because they're going through hell. Their life is shitty. They have nothing to live for. Nobody wants them. Nobody really cares. They're not really getting any attention. No clout. This person has no motion. They're yellow busy. So they're mad. They're really just mad at you and mad at your life, okay? I just see 614 on the timer. Okay. Yeah, my ancestors finna come through on your goof ass. They finna let you know what it is. Not y'all collective, but the goofies out here that's trying to play y'all. Ancestors, come through, please. What's the energy for my collective? Ancestors most high divine being mm -hmm. of all ancestral realms come on what's the energy for my collective they're like nothing because they some non-factor ass people i'm telling you my ancestors is tired of talking about the same shit here we go Ooh. 
got to fix the cars a little bit. Yeah, nightmare daggers. Whatever they try to throw at you is happening to them, like I said. They're being haunted with their own weapons at this time. The eternal has definitely stepped in. Mm -hmm. You're eternal. You're immortal. They can't kill you. They can't stop you. Period. The terror of crystals. They could be using crystals to do magic against you or to go up against you in some kind of way. What else for the collective? So they're having nightmares at this time. They're being terrorized by their own like crystals and spiritual things that they're using to try to tear somebody else down. It's tearing them down. Okay, ancestors, come through, please. What do we need to know for the collective? What does the collective need to know? Yeah, Ace of Daggers, that's the truth. Everything I just told you was true so far. Mm -hmm. That could be air energy. It's a lot of air energy out here. Earth energy, air energy. Yeah, two of daggers. I feel like it's two people trying to go up against you. Like I said, it's a couple. It's the same shit. They need to get off this channel and get out this energy, period. You're doing too much. You're doing too much, okay? Actually, you're not doing enough. <laughs> Yeah, because the Eternal got your back out here. They not stopping shit. They not doing shit. Ancestors come through. Seven of Daggers. Yeah, you could have options out here. Or actually, no, Seven of Daggers. This person's being sneaky as well. So they're trying to sneak and do something. This person might try to come towards you on October 7th. Or you could be on Life Path number 7 or Life Path number 2. Okay. Or July could be significant or February. Yeah, this person could be having an afro. They could have some kind of fro or horns. The devil, masquerade of bone. Mm -hmm. Spirit is having a party with this motherfucker. It's a whole bunch of shit going through their head. <laughs> Let me push this back so y'all can see it better. Yeah, 7.14 on the timer. How did I do that before? It was like this. Because usually I don't show y'all the cards. But I'm going to start kind of like, you know, showing y'all the cards a little bit up close and personal. A little bit better. Yeah. Yeah, but the hangman, this person feeling stuck for all the, the spirit got them choked up right now. I feel like all the bullshit they doing or trying to send out to the world is coming back around to them. So this person like, how the hell does that shit come back to me? So they're looking stupid. 7.55 on the timer. This person's stuck. Looking dumb. As usual. Yeah, justice. Angels call justice. Judgment. Libra energy. Yeah, this person knows there's an ending coming. This person could be passing away as well. They're like a fucking bag of bones with a big ass afro. Yeah, but justice is being served at this time. What's going on for the collective? Two or three more cards, please, for the collective. Yeah, seven of cups. This person's trying to block your options or send people your way. Yeah, with the nine of bones, it could be nine people or up to nine people, five of bones. I feel like they're trying to get rid of somebody. They're trying to bury somebody. With the four of bones, they're trying to kill them and steal their stability. With the four of cups as well, with the happiness, it could be a water sign. Okay. Yeah, Nightmare of Cups is a water sign. So yeah, they're doing, they're trying to send a water sign nightmares or they're having nightmares because of something they did to a water sign. Okay, two more Holy Spirit. Mm -hmm. Spirit is talking, Master Ray of Cups, yeah. They're putting them to an end because of what they're trying to do towards a water sign. Your ancestors have stepped in, three, six, nine. Okay, one more Holy Spirit for my collective, please. One more. Yeah, the eight of crystals, all the hard work that you're putting in, they're trying to steal it. Mm-hmm. With the eight, they could have did something last or on like in, uh, in August with the eight, eight portal. This person could have did some kind of magic using crystals. Mm-hmm. And with justice, your angels are watching. They're going to bring in some kind of justice. Let's see. It's always about money, magic, somebody trying to steal somebody. Man, let me see. I feel like, 
and we should use probably these for a second just for a hot second i don't want to use like let me see yeah we're gonna use these spirit is saying do these i just seen 10 15 on the timer what is the nightmare of cups holy spirit for the collective clarify the nightmare of cups yeah outside forces so yeah outside forces is fucking them up at this time for trying to come towards a water sign or do something with the water sign or do some water magic to try to drown a water sign something like that hmm so like if you're an air sign they might try to kill you with a sword if you're a water sign they'll try to kill you with some water if you're a fire sign they'll try to set something on fire if you're an earth sign they'll try to do something like natural disaster is what i'm picking up on with this person yeah this person is going to try to roll the dice and do it again with the eight of crystals you're going to still keep trying to do this because eight of eight of crystals is like putting in work or walking away from a situation or eight because you know eight of cups in original tarot eight of cups will be um like work or walking away like, you know, all the um, energy that you put into something. So I feel like this person's putting in a lot of energy to what they're trying to do. They're trying to keep some shit connected, something together. I just seen 1126 on the timer. So they're going to roll the dice and, like, do the stupid shit again. I guess they're not going to learn until they get to the crossroads with the devil. <laughs> Eternal. Yeah, this person has a lot of drama. This person's trying to send you a lot of drama. With the uh, Terra Crystals. They tried to send you some kind of chaos and drama, but it didn't work. Yeah, your money matters. They're worried about your money. Like I said, it's about money, finances, wealth, stability, your independence. They don't like your independence, your money, and your wealth. It's all about your wealth and your protection. Protection is right there. You're shredding them off. You have courage. You lay some shit on the table. You're keeping it real at this time. They could be having flashbacks and nostalgia and memories. Okay, what's the eternal? Okay, clarify the eternal. The eternal. Yeah, looking. The eternal is looking in on something. I feel like your ancestors is watching. You're like, uh-huh. And it's right across from Ace of Daggers, which is the truth. Clarify the Ace of Truth. What is the Ace of Daggers, please? Ace of Daggers from my collective. This person could try to stab you or something. Oh, no. What's the Ace of Daggers, please? My third eye is itching. Ace, the Ace of Swords is they're trying to steal your um, joy and you're moving up to the top. This person is trying to steal your success and your freedom. Okay, let's clarify it though, please. Thank you. Yeah, they're trying to steal your manifestations. Mm -hmm. This came on the last reading. Clarify the masquerade of bones. I feel like all the person, all the person, all the people that's doing magic, they're just like a hair. 1223 on the timer, they just have hair. They're like a bag of bones. They sit up all night. They don't go to sleep. Whoo! And they got like three skulls connected to their head. That's weird. Like, I feel like it's three demons like telling them what to do, like how to do this. Yeah, masquerade of bones. They made an offering. I cannot make this up. Hold on, my third eye is itching. They made an offering to the devil. You see the horns? They made three offerings. They could have made an offering to the devil or something like that. Mm -hmm. And those offerings are bad. They're not wish fulfillment as well. Okay, what is the two of daggers? Clarify the two of daggers. Yeah, it's like a bunch of dirty ass offerings in reverse. The two of dagger. Two motherfuckers wanna go up against you and try to take your freedom, but your but your um energy is light as a feather. You don't carry heavy weight. You're not like a dark person, so they're trying to go up against you. They need two of them because they know one is not enough. You're too powerful, you're too strong. And the devil is like, oh, we need both of y'all. But they can't steal your freedom because it's locked. They can't tap into your energy. You have too much harmony. Period. What's the seven of diamonds? What's the sneaky ass energy? Perspective. Mm-hmm. Seven of daggers. This person's trying to see shit from a different perspective. They're trying to be sneaky and come in and try to get you to see something from a different perspective. They're stuck with the hangman. 
they can't make no progress at this time. Okay, what's the hangman? Yeah, I'm hearing step, seeing, I seen take steps, expression, the hangman. Ha <laughs> ha, they wanna express themselves. they got something to say, but they feel stuck, they can't say it. Or spirit is expressing some shit to them, making their ass sit there and listen to what's going on. You listen up. Thou shalt not touch my anointed, okay? What's the masquerade of cups? Because you got the masquerade of bones and cups. Mm -mm. Putting dreams in a jar. Like, all that goofy shit. Okay, what is this? What's the masquerade of cups for the collective? Unfolding. Whatever they did is unfolding. Uh-huh. Things are coming to the light. We're going to go to a different deck. Yeah, they're trying to steal your gifts. They see you very gifted. 1557 on the timer. Oh, wait. Your gifts. Justice. So, I'm going to keep it like that. The gifts... Injustice. You're going to get justice on your gifts. They cannot steal nothing from you. Terror cups. Yeah, they're trying to manipulate a situation. Eight of daggers. This person's going to be defeated. They feel stuck. The terror of bones. I feel like this person's going to pass away. Period. Yep. Get off that bullshit. Mm -hmm. Six of bones. You got that third eye open. You side eye motherfuckers at this time. You like, uh -uh on that bullshit yeah let's do this y'all want to be on that bullshit let's do it all right let's see we're gonna go to probably gonna i was gonna use the animal oracle i'm gonna do the white cards at the end um let's see who are these people the eternal, the outside forces. Night. Where's the nightmare cups with the outside forces? Who is that? Who's getting haunted with nightmares? Who's trying to, yeah. They're getting haunted for trying to steal your sudden wealth. They're getting nightmares. 11, 11 on the timer. 12, 12 on the timer. 17, 17 as well. What's the drama? And roll the dice. This person's working hard to do something. They're trying to send in a lot of outside forces to try to block your sudden wealth. Mm -hmm. This person can owe you money, jurisdiction, justice, uh-oh, uh-oh. Somebody got to go to court. I feel like this person's going to jail. You could be a life path number 11, or your birthday could be the 30th of any month, or the 11th of any month, okay? It's a lot of drama going on in court. This person facing a lot of legal issues. Yeah, pathway. They want to come towards you because they know your pathway is open. The eternal. I feel like the eternal with the looking you up and watching. Eternal. You could be 35 or someone in the spirit realm is 35 that's watching over you. Ancestors come through. What's the freedom card and the two of daggers and the crystal of daggers? Yeah, despair. This person's mad because they cannot take your freedom. You could be 32 or they could be 32. What's the manifestation? Ace of daggers. The truth is they're trying to steal your money, your wealth, your abundance. That's the truth. This past lover, this karmic lover. Fortune. I cannot make this up. Yeah, this past lover could be 26 or their birthday could be the 26th of any month. But they're trying to steal your manifestations, your great fortune with the ace of daggers. That's the truth. Mm hmm. Now, what's the offerings they made to the devil? The masquerade of bones. What's the offerings they made to the devil, Holy Spirit? What is the offerings that they made? Yeah, this main female. It was two people. Like I said, it's two karmics involved. And they made offerings to the devil on this main female. It's two people that went up against the main female. It's a karmic lover and then his new karmic bitch. And they went up against you, divine feminine or divine masculine. And then you could be a life path number two, or February could be significant, or the second of any month, okay? A wealthy man. So, <clears throat> they offered something to the devil. Two people offer something to the devil on a main female. A wealthy man might know something. Mm hmm. What's the seven of daggers? What's the sneaky ass energy? Well, yeah, they're trying to steal your money and shit. And a child. The secret is they're being sneaky. They can have another child or they could be having other people go to court to pose as you for child support payments to get the money to come to them. They could have been trying to do this shit till the kid was 18 years old or some shit like that. 
or they could have been doing this for 18 months or 18 could be significant. The 18th of October could be a court date or their birthday could be on the 18th. You have this main male, number one. He could be a life path, number one, or his birthday can be in January. But somebody's all up in their thoughts and they're stuck and they want to come in and express something. It's something they got to say. Mm -hmm. The 16th could be significant, but somebody thinking hard about what they should do next and how they going to try to go about a situation. Now, what's the masquerade of cups, Holy Spirit? What's unfolding? What is unfolding for the collective? Who? What is unfolding for my collective, please? I think it's a false person or a message. Yeah, the message is coming out. Yep, you're going to be receiving a message. Number seven. You could be a life path number seven or your birthday could be the seventh of any month. And this person's in poverty. That's the message. The justice is your gifts. They're trying to steal your gifts. But justice, your gifts are protected. They cannot steal your gifts or take shit from you. Okay. Now let's go into... I feel like it's like a... Mm, we're not going to do that. We're going to do these. Let's go to our animal oracle and clarify some shit. Sudden wealth, outside forces. Let's clarify that. What is the current energy, please? Okay, a couple cards for the collective. I just seen 2137. The wolf, a pathfinder. Release the past to start a new journey. You are the teacher and help. And, hold on. You are the teacher and help others find their way. There will be challenges, but you are a strong soul. Preserve your secret powers. You have love that endures. My nose is just somebody talking about you. But yeah, this is also I'm giving me a wolf in sheep's clothing. But they know that you have hidden knowledge and you're the pathfinder. And you're going to find out about some shit. Or you're going to find this sudden wealth. You're going to know. The outside. You, you can feel the outside forces. What's the drama card? Mm. It's a lot of foxes and wolves out here. Look at this. Clever. Oh, look at this. Look at this. Look at this. The black jaguar. Uh -huh. The old soul. Ooh, this is looking good. Okay, so the fox. You are swift and smart. Solutions to problems are easily found. Always listen to your instincts. Resourceful resources are around you. And be open to romance. So, yeah, your instincts and your gut feeling is telling you something about a court situation or somebody owing you some money or something ain't right. Um, Black Jaguar also walk through life with confidence and grace. You have the power from beyond the world. Focus on what you really want. You can create your dreams. Yeah, this person knows you're a creator. You're very loving. They know you trust your path and they're trying to take you off that motherfucker. The White Sage Protector came out right by the angel. Ooh, wait, 2310. You are an old soul. They came out twice. Your best friend is nature. You can be an earth sign. Your intuition is to take you where you want to go. Awaken the powerful source, force from within. You are meant to create blessings with your magic. Sorry about that. You are meant to create blessings with your magic, with the white sage. Talks about old soul twice. Magic twice. Mm -hmm. This person know that you got the real magic. They don't really hold no magic. They just do magic, but you are magic. You get what I'm saying? Like 2345. I feel like somebody that's doing magic, they just do it. Like they just go in the kitchen and whip up spells and like come up with shit and look at YouTube and look at like look at shit. But you know shit. You already are the magic. You know how to make shit pop without going to go, like actually going to go do magic. You are magical. You are the abundance. You are the gift. <laughs> you don't need to get gifts. You are the gift. You get what I'm mean? saying? Yeah, the tiger, fire. You could be a fire sign. You chose to be unstoppable. Passion is your power. You are brave, bold. Mighty forces come to an aid. Exactly. So I feel like you got all this strength around you. Leo energy, all these tires, all these tigers, jaguars foxes and wolves and shit like that the squirrel you're always prepared you stay ready so you don't gotta get ready period we gonna pull one more of these you got the raccoon the adventure decide on what you really want you have the integrity to claim it avoid being avoid being the trickster and practice integrity you may 
you have many roles, you can juggle them well. So basically, you a shapeshifter. You know how to switch shit up. 2606, you know how to like, you have integrity. You're not a trickster. You practice, you practice things before you do it. And you juggle things really good. You can multitask, okay? You're a multitasker. And you're very swift and clever at whatever it is that you do, period. Somebody is really mad about that. Somebody wants some kind of attention, but they're not getting it. Look at all this. The Lennox, the keeper of secrets. Take time from the outer world to observe. Nothing can be decided when you can when you trust yourself. It says you see other secrets and keep them sacred. In silence and solitude, you find strength. So basically, people might tell you stuff and you're a really good secret teller, storyteller at that. You might do tarot cards. People might come to you and tell you secrets or something like that. You can have a platform that encourages people to get up and do shit. Okay, take action. The time is now. Now, opportunities is here. Move forward with confidence. Your talent is already with you. Exactly. Remember I said the magic is within you. You don't have to go do any magic. You have a quick wit and keen sense. Let your success lead the way. Period. Let your money speak for itself. Let your success be the only noise. Don't go back and forth with no fucking peasant. Grace. Your name can be Grace. Yeah, you ain't going back and forth with no peasant. The polar bear. You're very mystical. Know the challenges make you stronger. Have faith in when you face adversizing, adversity. Um, take time to rest. Dream. Renew your strengths. Embrace your psychic abilities. You carry the shaman within. Yeah. This person knows you have psychic abilities. You can see that they're a fucking liar. You can see what they're trying to do. They know that you know what's up. Okay, let's pull some cards. Yep, this motherfucker is a master manipulator. They're going to show you some fake love. They could be 36 or dealing with somebody that's 36. The magic spells is not working. This person is big mad. The person that they're with, she hates your aura. Because you're so fucking pure. This this karmic ass hating ass bitch, twenty two seventeen. She's jealous of you. Hates your aura because you're so beautiful and so pure. United Kingdom could be significant. Okay, what else is going on? Yeah, summer fling turned into everything. He got the karmic bitch pregnant. Now he's stuck with her. What I was telling you. Yeah, the tea is spilling. Boiling hot collective. Whatever I'm telling you is spilling right now. Mm -hmm. It's the truth. Messages of clarity and truth. Yeah, you're a diamond in the rough. Now they see you rising. So they're mad. 515 Des Moines, Iowa could be significant. Mm -hmm. A red Mercedes any year. You look better than her on your worst days. Ooh. He might have told her some shit like that. Like, man, my baby mama look better than you. <laughs> 707 on the timer. The only time you look back is to see how far you come. They going back and forth. 999. They're going back and forth and arguing about you daily. Wow. Just wow. You got in your bag. Yeah, your book. You could be a book writer. Somebody always making shit up or they trying to, are they trying to alter your story? Remember, you're the only author of your story. You might have to slap a bitch today. Okay. Let a bitch know what the fuck it really is. A mortician, makeup for the deceased. I told you somebody finna pass away out here. Uh-huh. 29 can be significant. This person can be 29. Who's chasing who? What? Who's chasing who? Okay. Tennessee could be significant as well. And we got 809. Ohio could be significant. And then there's a third party on the line. Yep. Third party karmic ass bitches listening in on what you trying to say. Uh-huh. They not liking the video, but they show watching. 2903. Period. They don't like it because it's about them. Of course, you're not going to like something if it's about you. Yeah, they're doing mirror magic, 29, 12, trying to steal your identity, your features. Get the fuck out of here. They keep their, they keep your name in their mouth. They argue about you every day. You're not even there. 29, 20. Period. They're very choked up about you. You got a brand new beginning. They can't fool you for a second. This person feel like the whole world is against them, too. The Louisiana, they could be doing dark magic over there or know somebody over there. They playing a dangerous-ass game out here. And here I come. La La Brooke. Uh-oh. Here we come. Uh-oh. Here I come. 2024. I'm coming right here, right now for you. Right here, bitch. 2024. This year. I'm on your ass. Something about yesterday. 
karmic love triangles infected this person. They trying to bring that shit towards you, period. You're moving underground. Harriet Tubman. <laughs> Canada could be significant. You can live in Canada. Something about Sunday, okay? And yesterday. Something happened yesterday, Sunday, and last night. They going through a lot, baby. Motherfuckers want to... Yeah, I'll brush your hair and put your do-rag on. You about to be in love with a whole new man with some fresh-ass waves. The villains. <laughs> so as I open up the day, they're in a dark-ass place. They ain't got nowhere to go. Spirit is on their ass. But you're looking good. Okay, light worker, keep going, baby girl. You're applying pressure right now. You got these hoes really mad, really in their feelings. You thought she was mad before, bitch, just wait. 7.45 on the timer. You could be a cake maker or you about to get ready to get married or you could be using that Truly's butt stuff cake maker that I talked about in one of my beauty videos, okay? They tried to shut you up and silence you. They got a karmic ass baby mama and she's only a weekend girlfriend. She ain't nobody. That bitch ain't a nobody. Still, tell that bitch to stop calling your phone. She's a nobody. 31 on one. They got a crazy ass lifestyle as well. And somebody mad as fuck. Mm-hmm. And thanks for reaching out, bad bitches. I hope this video resonates. And don't forget to like and subscribe. It would be gladly appreciated. I love you guys. Peace.